Forget about carbs and potatoes. Get creative in the kitchen with this delicious low-carb corned beef hash recipe that uses turnips instead of potatoes. First, we're going to peel and dice two cups of turnips, dice them into a fourth inch pieces, and then set them aside. Boil the turnips in boiling water for about seven minutes. And I put a little bit of salt inside the water and put the turnips in while it was boiling. You want to test it with a fork and make sure that they're easy to pierce and drain. Once you drain them, spread them out onto some paper towels and let them dry some more because boiled turnips have a lot of moisture in them. Dice a half of a cup of onion and set that aside. You want to use about a pound of corned beef. If you're using leftover meat, finely chop it. I used a can of chopped corned beef that was about 14 ounces, so pretty close to a pound. Heat your frying pan over medium heat and add ghee, beef tallow, butter, whatever your choice is. I use baking drippings in the video, and um, you're going to put in two to three tablespoons of this. Once that's hot, you're going to add the diced onions and the dried cooked turnips that you put onto the toweling, and you're going to put them in the frying pan and saute it until the onions are golden brown. And then you'll see in the video where I've kind of spread them apart because I wanted to put the meat in the middle of the pan. So you're going to add your chopped corned beef to the frying pan and mix it all together with the onions and the turnips. Then you're going to add a half of a cup of heavy cream. You could use heavy whipping cream or heavy cream. If you don't want it that heavy, you could use half and half or milk, but the cream did well. And then you want to stir that together. Now once it's stirred together, you want to let it sit over medium heat for about three minutes. You're looking for the bottom to start to turn dark but not be burnt. And then you're going to stir it up and then let that sit again for a few minutes. Check the bottom when it's starting to turn a little bit, stir it again. And keep doing that rotation of stirring and letting it sit until you see the brown bits like you want it to be. And you want it to dry a little bit, but you don't want it to be too dry to be able to eat it. When it's done, you want to serve this either by itself as the main dish or you could serve it with eggs. I had it for a wonderful brunch and really enjoyed this. And what I really liked was the turnips had no flavor that made me know that it wasn't potatoes. The texture was right. The color was right. The taste was just the corned beef. And I really enjoyed this. I, I hope you like it. I appreciate you watching the video. If you're not following the channel, be sure to subscribe for more cooking and household tips, recipes, and ideas. And I'll see you in the next video.